I, I grew up around a cricket club. It's just it's a good game to play. Originally I played cricket with my father and now I'm lucky enough to be able to play with my son um, and my brother as well. Uh, my stoma I got just over three years ago. My sort of mindset is I've got one, I can deal with it, I accept it. Hi, I'm Kev. Uh, this is my girlfriend Abby. Hello. Uh, my mum Kath. Hello. My son Josh. Hi. And my brother Rob. Hi. When Kev um, couldn't play cricket, he was a nightmare. <laughs> Um, from when he had got out of hospital, he would set himself um, a target and he'd even got a sheet which countdown of the days to the start of the cricket season. He plays every Saturday and sometimes in the week and trains in the week and occasionally on a Sunday as well. Yeah, I think definitely the Bravo Protective Seal was probably the final step. Experienced one or two leaks when I was playing cricket and sport, particularly when I got sort of quite hot and sweaty and it seemed to absorb some of that moisture. Just sort of helps sort of close the gap between the, the base plate and my stoma, and it really does make a difference. And what I found was that it's given me a sort of an increased confidence and security that I'm not gonna have leaks. He steadily got back to being himself um, more and more as time's gone on. You've gotta have freedom of movement. You need flexibility, you need to be able to move quickly. What I have noticed with the, the protective seal is that it does feel like the seal's sort of almost following my body. Again, it's just a peace of mind, a comfort. At the moment, I'm claiming I'm the better cricketer. <laughs> Definitely me. <laughs> He's had a lot more years to practice, hasn't he? So Obviously, there was a few months of him getting fitter, but after that, it was back to like the old days, you know. Nice to see him back to doing what he loves because for, for so long he couldn't get out and do it. So he's got back to pretty much where you want mm. to be, haven't you? And yeah, well, I'm incredibly lucky and will always be incredibly grateful. <laughs>